Hello and hi there. Welcome back. Today we're going to ask this question: What is a 404? We call it a 404 error page. And um, yeah, it is actually a pretty uh, weird how these numbers just appear on a website. I'm sure you have seen them, but uh, let me explain to you um, what this means first, and I'll show you a problem and an example. So. A 404 error page is a response code from the server, and it's essentially a file not found. And it's returned from the server, indicating that a problem uh, happens because they can't find that page or that resource at that time, right? And that can even be a PDF document or an image or the actual page itself, many things, but uh, truly uh, it cannot find that resource, right? Now here's an example that I wanted to share with you. I uh, just grabbed a URL, sportsandoutdoorgear.com, and I put a forward slash bob.html. Any file will do, right? But just to see if they're handling this response correctly. And a no is the answer. Not found. The requested URL bob was not found on this server. A 404 not found error was encountered. This is bad news. Both users and search engines hiccup big time on this, right? I mean, users, they're appalled at this, right? What are these guys thinking? I mean, are they even, you know, uh, are they a legit outfit? Should they even be on the web, right? Many questions asked. Search engines come to a complete stop here. The spiders, they don't know what to do with this, right? And in fact, it's a health degrading thing. Um, and this can be easily handled by just adding a page on the server either on IAS or Apache servers and just actually saying, listen, you have found a resource not available and uh, click here to continue. As simple as that, right? And that file itself, we're going to get into how you may exclude that from search engines. You don't want the 404 to even be displayed and you can actually tell the search engines to not index it. But that gets a little bit more advanced than this question which we had, uh, what is a 404 error page? Uh, we told you, uh, or I told you, that it's a file not found and I showed you an example of that. And you can test it on your own site right now. Just go ahead and type your domain name .com or .net, whatever you have there, forward slash some random name dot and whatever extension, right? And if you don't have a proper 404, you got to fix it, guys. Uh, this is not good if you are uh, not handling it. So, hope you enjoyed this video, and we'll see you in the next one. Cheers and out.